So we have volume we want to calculate by between 3x and x squared, and we want to wrap it around the, the y-axis, so it's going to look something like this. So here's this. So we're going to go, f these, com the, uh, well, we're not set when uh, the points are so zero to some value here. So we do x squared is equal to 3x. So zero is a solution. And the other solution, of course, divide by x, divide by x, x is equal to 3. So we're going to integrate from zero to 3 in this instance. Oh, you know what? I feel kind of silly. Uh, the points are right here. OK, so. Um, we're using the shell method. So in this instance, it's just going to be 2 pi x. And we're integrating from 0 to 3. And our values are going to be 3x minus x squared. So we're going to distribute the x. So we get 2 pi from 0 to 2, or 0 to 3, for 3x squared minus x cubed dx. OK. Um, all right, so we integrate, so we end up with 2 pi, and we get 3x cubed over 3. Actually, it just ends up being x cubed, because the 3 on the bottom cancels out the 3 coefficient 3, minus x to the fourth over 4, 0 to 3. All right, so we end up with, um, the zero ends up doing nothing, but we get three cubed minus three raised to the fourth over four. So what we end up with is two pi 27 minus 81 over four. And finally, what this comes down to is the volume is gonna be equal to 27 pi over two. Because what this ends up being is um, 162 over 4. It's 4. No, that's not right. It's 54, 108, divided by 4. Yeah, so this ends up being 108 divided by 4. Then you get 54 over 2, which is 27 over 2 times, or 27 over 4, or 54 over 4, and then times 2, and divided by 2. So yeah, okay. So 27 over 2. Okay, that's it. I hope that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.